Clint here, dadding every day, working on the 04 bends. So, what we've done here is got this guy, and somebody thought it would be a good idea to make it a low rider by puncturing the airbag. Now, they've done this at all four corners, so we're testing a quick fix by using the what do you call them? The tire plug kits. So I have all new airbags for all four corners. Um, I ran ran the the air pressure test. Clearly, these guys leaked. That looked like they used a screwdriver and just hammered it in. So I wanted to see if it'd leak with the plugs in. I didn't trim them so you could clearly see them. We're gonna see if it'll hold pressure. At the same time, we're gonna be doing a review of the Maxidos DS-808. All right, so we're going through the Maxidos DS-808. We're gonna be going over the aromatic functions on it. So we're gonna go into diagnostics. We're gonna be selecting Benz since we're working on the 2004 Mercedes Benz E500. Uh, you will have to do a download when you get this in a registration where the E Class, the 211 chassis, and we're a 283 is the body code. We're formatic, so you do kind of need to know that about it. Um, I did the VIN search earlier and it didn't really work, so it's better to just know this. Up to 05 since we're 2004. We're not a sedan, so we're a T model and we're not uh, long because we're not a limousine. Although it does get the VIN, it didn't do the other for some reason, but manual selection works best. So we need to go into the Gnostic control unit chassis and then we want to go into suspension and active tests is where we'll be able to load these now since we've put the plug in it was reading zero so we'll fill suspension struts we'll go to the right side the right side was the, the really bad side and you can see that it's still reading zero so we're going to go ahead and fill it see if it'll hold anything and it's going to continue to bleed off um i've i've tried this and it just has more issues than just that one puncture the good news was that this left side will hold with that plug so you can see it's holding at 11 psi which is great so if you were ever in an emergency situation and you had a pinhole like that and you needed to fill it you could get by with this so we, we'll go ahead and we'll add some air to it I'll show you that we can add pressure and that it works so you'll see a spike and then it'll level out so the strut's sitting at 17.95 right now what's cool about this is we can actually go back out of this. I didn't put any in the back. Um, we can release pressure out of that. Now there's no pressure to push it out, but we can release some pressure and some of it will bleed out. So we'll go ahead and we'll bleed some off. It'll tell you it's active and you'll see it drop a little. Maybe. <sighs> huh? It did last time. It's trying, but I can hear it trying to do stuff, but we can check our central valves. We can check our damper valves. So that'd be for like your sport mode. Um, we turn those on and off. So F3 is on. Oh, get that back up here. 
So we can see that it's on. We'll turn it off. We can turn both on, or both on F3, F5. So that would be um, what sport at sport performance. We turn both off, or maybe I've told it's both off. Yeah. And you can do that at all four corners. Uh, you can fill your central air re reservoir and you can empty it. So we can see that we can go ahead and put air in the central reservoir. And we can release pressure in it. Oh, never mind, we can't because the central reservoir isn't holding anything because all my struts are, all of them are bad. So, well, there's going elsewhere, anyways. You could, you know. If you had them, um, special functions, you can do our test of the aromatic compressor unit. So if you think your compressor is going bad, you can see if it's actually your problem. This is a new compressor and I've done the test so I know it's good. Uh, you can look at your live data, your level sensors. Uh, I'm on jack stands. So my stuff's going to be off because I'm not necessarily level. Um, yeah. So it's actually a pretty, pretty good system for kind of doing everything. Uh, I haven't actually gone through and done a whole lot other than the aromatic because that was my main focus. So as I go through and uh, do up the rest. I'll kind of give you guys a walk around of what my my big fixes were at, or are.